Hey everybody, welcome back to Pittsburgh Today Live. We are still hanging outside of the PTL studios and typically when I'm doing a live shot on location, Heather will toss to me from the studio. She'll say, you know, Selena, what's going on? What can you tell us about what you're featuring today? But now I'm actually going to throw it back inside to Heather Abraham inside of the PTL studios because Heather, did you know that your face, <laughs> you and David, are made out of chalk? Look at this beautiful Look at that. photo. Oh, no. I love it. It Wait, is so much up. fun. It's huge. Wait, hold on. I, it is huge. Heather. I like. I see. Yeah, you guys. Although you I'm look like dark. you. You look like you. David really looks like him. But <laughs> this is this is one of those pictures, Selena, where they they ask you to smile and then smile bigger and then keep smiling and look like you're having fun. Yeah. And then you're like, Ah, you're such a great time. I, you know, I love it, Heather. It's a big natural smile, and I know David is loving this. He's watching from home, but David has I think a lot this of is just spectacular. David has a lot of facial hair there, Selena. He does. Yeah. Look at that facial hair. Eric Greenewald, who is the artist, nailed it. So he is also known as the Chalking Dad. He is the creator of this masterpiece. Eric, how long did this take you to make, first of all? Uh, I spent about seven hours working on this chalk project altogether. Now, this, I can't believe this is made out of chalk. Like This is like chalk like you would do on the sidewalk with your kids. A absolutely, absolutely. It's a little more advanced version of some pastels and things, but absolutely. So, yep, anyone can start with chalking hopscotch boards and go to this over time. Now the big question is why did you make this beautiful creation of David and Heather? Yeah, well, love the show, love the hosts, love you guys uh, watching you, but we're also here to announce uh, that this weekend coming up at the Southside Works, we have the uh, Riverwalk and Chalk Fest coming and we have artists coming in from all around the country and creating masterpieces like this on the streets of Southside Works. I was going to say, where exactly is it? So it's all in the Southside Works. Yep, absolutely. Yep, we'll be on 27th Street uh, this weekend, Saturday from 2 to 6 p.m. Artists will start creating pieces tomorrow. Hoping the rain holds off long enough for us. But. Oh, it'll hold off. So uh, this will be a lot of fun. I know you have participated in different festivals all over the country. Is this one of the first to come to Pittsburgh, like a chalk festival? Yeah, so I participate in chalk festivals all around the country, all around the world, and I've always wanted to bring one here to Pittsburgh. And I'm excited to be able to partner with uh, River Life and Made in Pittsburgh to be able to make this happen. So really, it's the first of its kind here in um, here in the city. Well, I know that you are one of many different artists who will be participating this weekend. We want to find out more about this great celebration and festival. So I'm going to first go to Channing Powell with Made in Pittsburgh. This event sounds like so much fun and it's not just the beautiful artwork. You're going to have music and food trucks and all kind of fun stuff. Yeah, we have over a dozen food trucks, food and fun trucks we like to call them. Uh, Gordo's will be serving up some cocktails as well as Bombay. So it's for the whole family. Everybody can enjoy it. Kids, there's face painting, airbrush tattoos. Um, we have Strange Roots and Trace Brewing serving up some drinks as well. Um, but yeah, street performers, like I said, great event to kick off the summer. Oh, well, we have Ra Marissa Ramirez here as well. She is with River Life because all of the proceeds are going towards River Life, right? Absolutely, yes. So we're a nonprofit working on activating and creating really beautiful riverfront spaces here in Pittsburgh. So we are so excited to join on to this event. And I believe some of our artists are actually going to be uh, celebrating the rivers through some of their art pieces. So we're very excited about that. Oh, we are so excited. I mean, this will be a fabulous event. Thank you, ladies, so much for coming on to tell us more about it. Now, the other question I have for you, Eric, before we go, what can we do with this? Are, is this David and Heather's to keep forever? Absolutely. Absolutely. I hope you, uh, hope you folks enjoy it. You are so talented, and we can't wait to see what you create this Saturday on the South Side. So, Heather, I'm going to bring this in to you. You can keep this forever. You know what? I think that our boss would love this. I so think so. Put it up in his office. Yes. <laughs> right. Me too. Like, look. Or there you can put you it like in your like bedroom. Good morning. Like, you would, I don't know. That might be when weird. I don't know. Yeah. David in no. the bedroom. I don't know. Okay. <sighs> Anyways, moving on from that awkward subject, yes. thank you so much, Selena. <laughs> All right, the first annual South Shore River Walk and Chalk Fest takes place Saturday, May 28th from 2 to 6 at South Sad Works River Walk.